what's going on everybody here and welcome back to some more dredge i know i'm addicted it's it's a thing i'm addicted it's fun and it's fantastic and today we are starting off oh we're starting off so exciting by upgrading to the max tier four hull upgrade that's what we're gonna start with and then we're gonna try to get these upgrades but we got some new areas to check out we got some new things to do so let's go ahead let's just get started into this hopefully you guys enjoy if you do make sure you leave a like smash the thumbs up button if that's something you're into and let's get this hole upgraded shall we so i already got everything i needed for it wham bam oh we've made it so and adds 15 new cargo spaces hull can sustain one additional impact let's see what the hull looks like now oh it's like a beautiful red color okay so hold on let's look at my storage now oh my gosh look at all of the storage space we have that's absolutely insane all right so now um i want to go in and i want to get these so i've got so much storage here i've got to get rid of some of this um this scrap <laughs> because it's keeping everything everything is like completely full so let's go ahead and get all the scrap placed and hopefully there's enough that it takes it all because i don't know what to do with it later like now that i have everything done i don't feel like i'm gonna need it anymore you know what i'm saying so we might actually be throwing away scrap from now on or just not going after it uh let's see yeah, so like that's all the scrap that I think I need. Like period end dot done. With scrap. Yeah, I think we're done with scrap. Okay. So the first thing I think I want to go for is I feel like the cargo spaces. Like the cargo spaces I feel like are like the, you know, the necessary thing that you got to go for. So we'll go ahead and we'll do what we can here with those. Um I'm going to be short on the wood. So I need four more pieces of wood for that. And then let's see the one after that. I'd like to get engines going oh, I need more wood for that. Well, lights, I need wood for that. <laughs> what about this? Okay. Um, it looks like we're, oh, we just need wood. That's it. Literally just need wood and we're done. So we need one, two, three. Well, hang on, hold on. Uh, we need three. Oh my gosh. We need, uh, four more for that. So seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. We need 12 pieces of wood and then we can completely finish our upgrading, upgrading our ship. This is so exciting. I'm so excited. I'm just so excited. I'm so excited. So, uh, what do we got to do? Well, oh, let's go ahead and grab that. Definitely need that. And let's get some research going here. So we're getting close to getting this harvesting platform here. Now I really want to do engines, but I want to get this done first. Once we get this done, um, then we'll get this installed. Then we can harvest. We can go basically everywhere. I think. Um, actually, you know what? Let's hold off on that for now. Let's just let's just leave it. So, the next place that we have to go to is this spot right here. And I'm gonna tell you what. I went over here to this area. I just kind of wanted to check it out. But there's so much going on over there. I had to stop. I turned around and I left right away because I was like, there's too much going on here. We have got, <laughs> we've got to make this a video. So first things first, we are now maxed out on our hole. If we find boards, we can get boards. We can finish that off. I kind of feel like we should get the boards and just finish it. Um, but you know what? We'll go over to this new area and check this out because like I'm, like I'm telling you, it's so, it's so cool looking. Um, let's see. So yeah, we're basically going to head straight this way. Also, we can see my hole right here. I can take six hits right there. So that's, that's how much damage we can take um, total. So let's head over here. Uh, I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you right now. This area is really cool, but I think this might be like considered the mangrove area or something, where we need um, a specialty rod. I don't know. We'll have to see. But let's see. Where am I going? I'm going the wrong way. It's over here. Okay. It's that island right in front of us. Oh, see, I want to start fishing that stuff right there. Like that is gonna be so exciting. Get started fishing the um, the abyssal and the hadle or hadle or whatever it's called. That's gonna be so exciting. Okay, so this area right here, let's uh let's let's talk about this area real quick. It's a really cool area, and we need to go out in the middle of it, right? Dead in the dead in the center, okay? I'm gonna get just a little bit closer here. And you're gonna have to tell me if you could see anything in the water. You see uh you see any big huge tentacles sticking up? Um, yeah, I'm not sure how we're going to deal with that, to be honest. Um, I'm, I'm very scared to even go out there, but like, that's the spot we need to go to. So I don't exactly know what I'm going to be doing. With. I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. So, uh, yeah, that's, that's where we need to go. Now there's some other things here. I'm going to just kind of skirt around the edges because like I said, that is a giant monster. Um, and I think at nighttime, you can actually see its tentacles glowing, if I'm not mistaken. Um, 
but we need some fish here we're looking for a couple things what is this oh <gasps> this isn't the the snake merlin is it or the snake mackerel oh it's a barracuda Ooh, barracuda okay let's go ahead and grab a bunch of these we'll get some money um but there's some other things that I saw over here that I was like, oh, I don't even know what that is. So uh, we, I just left it. <laughs> I was like, we gotta, we, oh, that's a cool looking one. All right, let's see. It was over here. There was like a glowing red dot. Uh, hmm. Okay, you know what? Actually, it's about dark time. Here, you wanna see these, these tentacles are glowing. See them glowing? Oh, and there's this. What the heck is this? It's like octopus, octopi. Ooh, that's cool looking. Wonder if these things are worth some money. Ooh, interesting looking one there. Gotta get that money. All right, let's call that good. Those are really cool. See that thing right there. It's a red jellyfish. Like I want to go out there, but there's a there's a big huge there's a thing right there. I feel like we need to go out there and explore that jellyfish. All right, let's sell what we got. Uh, I feel like we're gonna make some decent money here. Four hundred and sixty-one. Are you kidding me? That's crazy. That might be the most money I've made at like one one time. Um, oh, you know what? Coastal, shallow, oceanic, and dredge. That's what we can get right now. Okay, cool. Um, so we didn't get anything else. Do we go ahead and sleep or should we, should we try to grab that? Is that thing still there? Oh, I really want to grab it. We got to go out and try to grab it. Unless it's going to hurt me. Oh. Kind of like pops. Mm. Maybe we'll just leave it alone then. And then let's go look at the shipyard. Do you have any upgrades? No pieces. We do have some new lights. Um, new lights might be handy as well. But I don't know. Actually, I need to throw that into storage. Let's throw that into storage. Okay. We're looking pretty good here. All right. So I'm just so curious as to what we're supposed to do with that thing. I know it's going to eat us. Like, I know it's going to. <gasps> Hold up. There's like a research station over here. Oh, and there's a bottle. Oh, there's wood. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There's wood right here. That's the one thing we need more. We need 12 pieces of wood to get our upgrades. All right, that spot's empty. Let's go ahead and pop this one open. There's a ring, but there could also be a research node here. Uh, just a ring. Okay. All right, hold on. There's this, like, there's this, this, what is this? It's like a castle fort thing over here. Uh, what are those? I'm looking for, I'm trying to find those Merlin, those, uh, mackerel that we needed in the last video. Oh, these are Barracuda. And we got another bottle here. Let's grab this bottle real quick. Let's see what's going on here. It's like a castle and like some guns and stuff. Researcher. Uh, hello. I wasn't expecting visitors. Who are you? I'm a fisherman. I guess I thought you had the look. But a fisherman all the way out here? Strange. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you. All the same. Um, I've not seen another soul in months. In fact, I could do with your help if you had time. What do you need help with? Um, I need help collecting samples of study. I was originally posted to research at the research outpost on the interior of the basin, but it was attacked. A large creature emerged from the depths and destroyed the outpost. Now it rests in the center of the basin. I fled here and have been uh, making do the best I can, but I have... A I had to leave most of my equipment behind, so now my research has come to a halt. Take a look at the list of specimens I need. Please drop them off. Um, you might need to experiment with different fishing strategies to collect all of them. Oh, we just got the glowing octopus. Darn it. 
and an aurora jellyfish okay so we need to get a net for that we can catch that one we can catch that one okay we can catch these two we need a um, we need a, a net for that one okay um about those specimens you're after oh yeah okay anything about the creature well i got the sense that it was attacking the research outpost itself rather than me specifically i suspect it was disturbed by some of the monitoring equipment there were dozens of machines running there all powered by a noisy generator it was huge larger than any other marine species i've studied it attacked with tentacles so i guess that's some sort of octopus or squid or an enemy <laughs> oh no it's a kraken uh one of my research festivals was moored around the back of the station so i managed to slip away while it was tearing apart the front there was a lot of valuable data and equipment left there but i'm not going back i can't i won't face it again is there anything else nope that's good all right so oh that's super cool it ate an entire research station <laughs> oh fantastic okay let's see here so we're gonna need some equipment to do this let's keep going around here let's see what we can find so we can find some more wood we got some rocks there man i really want to go out there but i'm scared that we're going to uh cause the thing to become mad what are these these look like angler fish oh <gasps> What is this there's like a broken down thing over here uh broken spectacles okay what is what is this laboratory generator the laboratory is in ruins with equipment and research papers strewn about the place uh what do you want to look at oh we gotta look at everything open the cupboards oh research heck yeah you empty the cupboards. What do you want to look? Uh, equipment on the table. Prototype parts on the table, but you can't see any use for them right now. On the other side of the table, you hastily scroll the notes. Not safe. Expect retaliation imminently. Uh, evacuating to fort. Where do you want to look? Look around the floor. There are cracks in the base of the structure that grow to large gashes as you follow them around the walls. Something extremely large and powerful created these holes. You slowly reach your arm into one. Oh, oh, goodness. I mean, that's, I mean, that's the best thing you could get, right? You pluck the item from the gouge on the floor. Um, okay, so that's all that's there. We got a generator. An old generator sputters and takes over. All right. Um, I guess we could, I guess we go ahead and just sleep for the night. So that's kind of a cool thing. There's the, um, the whole floating research base. So the, the Kraken went after that. I'm calling it, it's a Kraken. I don't even care. Ooh, more research parts. Yes, please. Oh man, we've gotten three research parts today, like already. That is fantastic. So, hmm. So we need a squid. We need a. <gasps> There's a whole bunch of pieces over here. Oh my gosh, all the woods. Yes, please. Oh my gosh, look how much wood we have. This is fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I feel bad for these uh these little huts here oh is that more wood um oh that's some cloth oh do i don't need a cloth right now though i'm not gonna pick up anything else yet that i that i don't need just because i'm not sure like what the i'm not sure what the point is you know i i can't sell it oh <gasps> wait do i still have that explosive in me ah oh, i put it in storage what do we have here stone hums quietly sending ripples to the air faint dances oh uh vanishing place your hand on the stone it does nothing yeah we already know that we haven't gotten an ability to touch stones and make magical things happen yet <laughs> i feel like that's coming soon though all right so i know we need an octopus which is right here so let's go and grab one of these guys for that lady And then we need a uh, we need a squid too. What are these? These look like they might be a squid or the octopus. That's more octopus. Hmm. These look like squid. 
Yes, perfect. Ah, oh, it's a... Uh... Oh, yeah, Firefly Squid. That's exactly what we needed. Okay, cool. So let's see how many upgrades we can get now. So floating dock. Let's start off with the, uh, the spaces. So upgrade that bad boy. And then let's go ahead and get... How many more? We have one, two, three. We have four more boards. I guess let's go ahead and get the two engine spaces. And then we'll throw these to the lights for now. So we need a total of one, two, three, four. Four more boards and then we'll be good. Okay. Now, shipyard. So we've got the ability to throw more of these jet drives in. We got two more spots here. And actually, you know what? I have one in my inventory. So we'll install that one and then let's go and get this one and install that one. So that's going to give us another 20 ish kilometers per hour or per whatever. Let's go ahead and get this in cargo because we know where you can use that somewhere. And then we need to take this to lady. Okay, so let's go ahead and sleep and then we'll take those to the, um, the other lady and we'll see if we get anything. I don't think we're going to get anything yet. Oh, look at us. We are cruising. I can't wait to get like those, like the top tier engines. It's going to be so much fun. I mean, like we're already going super fast. <laughs> All right. So researcher about those things you wanted. Here's one. And there's that one. So we need to get a Aurora jellyfish. It's caught in a, a net. You know what? I'm pretty sure. I'm almost positive. I don't even think, I don't even think I have the net anymore. I think I got rid of, I might've got rid of the net. Um, yeah, I did. I got rid of the net. I sold it cause I needed, I needed room for more scrap. <laughs> Darn it. All right. That's fine. So we need to get a net in order to get that going. Let's go to undock. Let's go and see, I guess we, I guess we could buy the net. Let's see if we can find any more wood anywhere else. Oh, we got something over here. What are these? Oh, a blood snapper. I mean, we need money anyways. <gasps> oh, more wood. Yes. Is it going to be four pieces though? It has medium high, medium stock. Oh, we just need four. That's all we need. It's going to give us two. Oh, it's going to give us three. And spot has been depleted. <laughs> all right. One more board is all we need. So I guess we can go ahead. Let's sell these, get our, get one of our more, one more upgrade. And then we'll go blow up one of those, um, one of those things. Uh, let's see. Floating dock. I want the light. For the rod space let's get the light done and then we'll go ahead and put these in here oh my gosh one board is all we need and 300 coin which we have let's go ahead and sell everything there you go and sleep all right let's go blow up this uh this thing over here maybe we can find a piece of wood in there Ooh, something don't sound very good. Pile of debris. Clear it. Oh, that's refined stuff. Okay, see, this is what I'm actually kind of curious about. It's like, okay, so we have this refined metal in here. Um, Can I sell this for money? Maybe we can sell scrap later. Maybe there's somebody that we can sell scrap to. Or maybe there's going to be a reason that we're going to need it for something. I have no idea. All right, we just need one more board. Let's see if we can find one board. 
Got something here. Some jewelry. Could be research though. Uh, it is a coin, a doubloon, <laughs> a singular doubloon. All right, I want to stop by this guy again um, because we need he needs this. We need a snake mackerel, I think is what it was called. And I want to see what it says it needs to be caught. Uh huh. Yep. Wait, what? Something seems. Wait, hold on. What? Pursuit resolved. Whoa, 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 what? What? The person passed away. Are you kidding me? I took too long. Oh. Well, dang it. Now I'll never know what they would have gave me. I didn't realize I had, had so much time. Um, okay, that's actually not good because, <laughs> because there's another one over there in gold. And I did the first one on it and I was like, oh, okay, we'll come back to it. Uh, yeah, that's not good. Darn it. Not good at all. Okay, I'm looking for literally one piece of wood. Like we've got, oh, 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 oh. We've got it right here. There it is. One singular piece of wood. Let's go put this upgrade on. Oh my gosh, we have got our ship fully, uh, fully maxed out now. Can't believe that guy passed away. I didn't think that was even like a possibility. Uh, dry dock this guy boom there it is upgrade we've done it everything we've got all the upgrades okay so now what we need to do let's look at our research here we have four parts we could start working towards these bigger engines i really want to because the faster we go <laughs> but we can't even we can't even get these so like I could unlock these two and I'm hoping that if I unlock these two, it'll let me start unlocking this. You know what? Let's do it. Let's go ahead and get this one. Does that mean I can get this one now? Harvesting platform now available in the stores. No, I still can't get that one. I must have to do a quest for it first. Yeah, I must have to do a quest for it first. Okay, so let's go ahead and put the rest of these into engines. We're gonna try to get up to this engine right here. Uh, because this twin is 36.8. I don't think what is our what's our layout look like now? So two by three and then these two. See, it's better to have these two engines. Actually, we do a uh, one, two, three. Oh, we can actually have three of these. We could even get more power in here. Yeah. Okay. So there's those. And then hold on. Let's go to, um, actually, you know, what, let's actually sleep. Oh, we have enough sleep for the next day. And then let's go to the ship right here. So we could put another one of these in, or we could even put two of these. That would be 30. Wait a second. Two spaces, three spaces gives us 26. If I put two of these in, that would give us 30. I could put one of these. No, it'd be better to put this and this in, huh? Yeah. Okay, so we'll do that. And then we'll go to storage, move that to here, put that in. Okay, so that's going to give us, that should give us more power than what we had before think right actually I don't even know hold on what is 9.5 times 3 ah <laughs> oh, you know what 9.5 times 3 is 28.5 so it'd actually be fast it would be better to get all of these because right now my power right now overall is 26.3 I'm not gonna count the 10% increase because like that's just across the board so right now we have a total of 88.4, but if I replace all of these with just these jet drives, that would be, hold on, let's see, we've got uh, four, eight, nine, ten. Oh, that'd be 90.5 or 95. 
They'd be faster to have all jet drives. How much are these things a piece though? Ooh, they're expensive. But I could probably sell all of these. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and do it. We're going to sell all of these. And we're going to install these on here. This is probably a terrible idea. Okay, so that's all I have right now. So we need to go. We need to go make more money <laughs> and uh, get more of these. Because that will give us a faster overall power. You know what? That won't be hard, though. We can get, we can get that money super easy. And then we do need to buy a, um, a a net as well again, but that's okay. Actually, let's go ahead and move. Did we get that new upgrade? Or Yeah, we did. We need to get this guy installed as well. Okay. Let's go make some money, and then we'll come back and get some more parts and upgrades and stuff. Oh, I'm so slow again. <laughs> this is terrible. <sighs> That's fine. Okay, so let's go ahead, let's sleep, and then we'll hopefully get another engine in the morning. <laughs> We're so slow, it's not it's not even funny anymore. It's not good. Uh engine. Yes. Okay, please. Install these engines for me. Uh let's see, we have three hundred and one. You know, let's go over to the uh let's go over to the, the other area. We're getting a lot more money from that new area. Well, the only problem is that we're not oh, we're gonna be so slow to get over there. <gasps> There's another boat. Is it actually there? Nope, not actually there. It's a figment of my imagination. Okay, let's see. We're gonna sell some stuff. We're gonna try to buy a new engine as well here. Uh, let's see. Fish market. Let's go ahead and sell everything. Ooh, 400. Yeah, see, we're making so much more here. And then let's go to the shipyard. Engines, you. And hopefully we'll sleep and then we'll get another one. All right, shipyard, do you have another engine for me now? Yes. All right, we're starting to get we're starting to get caught back up here on the speeds. What do we got here like a hammerhead? Holy moly. Wow. Hammerhead shark. Dang, look at that. That's that right there's a that's a specimen. Hopefully it's worth a lot. <laughs> Alright, let's see what a hammerhead shark is worth here. 233 by itself. That's uh that's pretty good. That's a pretty decent amount here. Check the shipyard. I don't think we got an engine yet because we haven't slept. So yeah, no new engine yet. Okay. All right, and a new engine. Let's get that installed here. Now I gotta actually see because this engine right here we got from somewhere else. So the bony blades of this grotesque engine are driven by a pulsing heart. It beats in time with your own. I don't know what the point in this is. Like I don't know if I really want this. So we'll probably end up swapping that out. Um, I did. We are going to keep this. So a uh, symbol of the deep is carved into its house. I think this increases the, the chance of finding um, like mutated fish. So I need kind of two more of these guys. And actually, how much money do I have? 627. So we have enough for both. Uh, you know what? Let's go do this. Let's pop on over to the Ingle, Ingle Island. And we'll grab the one for today, and then we'll grab the one for tomorrow, and then that should be our engines taken care of. And then maybe we can grab a uh, upgraded light too. We'll grab this big shark right here because this guy's worth some money. You know what? Let's go see if this guy's dead. <laughs> because it's been a while. I uh, I came over here. I gave him the first thing. I didn't realize that they could die. Something's wrong. The hooded figure slumped, long rows billowing violently. See no movement. Turn around and leave quietly. Yep. Darn it. Probably would have got something really cool from those guys. And I ruined it. <laughs> but the problem is that the thing that it needed was some abyssal thing. And I don't, I still don't even have access to um, anything to an abyssal anything yet. So. <gasps> oh, they don't have an upgrade. Oh, you know why? It's probably because it's technically the same person. Oh, darn it. <laughs> I was hoping we were going to be able to get another engine. So 
Uh, let's see. We have one, two, three, four lights. Do we have any? Huh. Interesting layout of the lights, you know? Mm, okay. Because there's not really a way to have two of them. I mean, I guess we could have uh, a big one and then like two little ones. Huh. Interesting. All right, let's go ahead and sleep and get these other engines in. All right, give me that engine. All right, hopefully our last engine upgrade is here. So shipwright engine. Yes, please. Okay, so let's go ahead. Uninstall that. Send it to storage and we'll go ahead and get this one in here. Now that gives us our maximum speed that we can currently have. <laughs> so that's awesome. And then let's go ahead and sell our fish. And then let's also go ahead and get our lights in here. So let's um, sell that lights. Let's go ahead and grab this one. And then I guess these two. So light up the night. Hey, you look like we got an achievement. Okay. Fishing speed, 160% boat speed is 105. And okay. So lights are looking good too. Now let's look at our fishing rig. So we need 720 for that. That's going to give us coastal shallow and oceanic coastal shallow. Actually, let's go ahead and sell that. Um, uninstall. We'll go ahead and put that down here. We'll grab you, put you there. Um, a swift reaper. Ooh, so coastal shallow and oceanic. So we don't need this anymore. So we can go ahead and sell that. Now the upgrade for that. We could get a, a net. We do need a net actually, but let's go ahead and let's do, let me look at the research here. So nets, coastal oceanic, coastal shallow, mangrove shallow, volcanic coastal. See, that's why I'm not sure. A shallow bottom design and a unique mesh structure allows this net to operate in shallow and silty water. This net's mesh has been treated to resist high temperatures and extreme conditions. So I'm not actually sure what, what net we need to, um, to find that last one. So maybe it's just the improved trawl net, or maybe it's one of these. I don't, I'm not actually sure. Cause if I go to this, can, I can't see like what the, what the area is. Hmm. You know what? Let's just grab the one that we can, um, the improved trawl net. We'll grab that, throw that in here. And then uh, we'll go see if we can get that jellyfish. So now we should be maximum speed. We should be able to fish everywhere. Holy moly. Yeah, we're cruising now. This is, <laughs> this is crazy. This is so much fun. I love it. Absolutely love it. Okay, so the auroral jellyfish, that's probably a nighttime thing, I would guess. But we'll throw our net out and we'll see what we cap capture here. Let's see, um, troll net, go ahead and lower that. These aren't mangrove, are they? No, these are just shallow. Okay. I guess we can go ahead and do some fishing for uh, some money too. All right, so we caught, we caught one fish. Let's see what we caught in our net here. Not what we needed. So let's go ahead and sell everything. And I guess we're going to go ahead and we're just going to start checking the shipyard for the, um, the research upgrades because we have, we have everything else. Like we're, we're good. We're, we've got it all. So it's about dark time. We're going to go in a circle here. Let's see if we can catch anything. Oh, we should be able to see how our, um, how our lights fare now. Hey, a royal jellyfish. There it is.
That right there is a tentacle. <laughs> Ooh. All right. Let's go ahead and let's head back here. Let's go ahead and check the shipyard. Make sure there's no goodies here. There's not. Okay, cool. Let's go. Uh, let's go deliver this stuff to the research lady. And I guess we're. Did I just break my boat? I did. Uh, why does Zalium under attack? <laughs> the music changed. I didn't like it. <laughs> All right, let's get this lady her stuff. See what we get out of this. Here we get some research pieces. All right, researcher. About those things. Uh, net. There it is. Boom, baby. Thanks. Looks like you caught all the surface specimens I needed. But uh, yes, I, I do need some from deeper down, but that's going to be a problem. Why is that a problem? I developed a device to retrieve samples from the abyssal zone. This was uh, over in the other research I post before the attack. I have an idea how to keep the creatures at bay long enough to collect these samples. But while I work on that, you need to retrieve some prototype parts. Careful. Carefully, I suggest you go during the day. I wouldn't want to be out of the reef at night. Is there anything else? Oh, no. Okay, cool. So that was where we were. And they're like, oh, there's some prototype parts that aren't going to be useful right now. So let's go grab those. So now we're probably going to get into the abyssal stuff. That's going to be super exciting. So let's just run over here real quick. Wait a second. Why did that say I couldn't fish that? Oh, that's abyssal or haddle. I don't, I don't know what the difference is yet. Okay. So this. laboratory um we need to look on the equipment on the table there we go okay prototype parts you still have prototype parts on board where do you want to look um i think that was it i think we looked everywhere else already generator undock all right let's go back to the lady so now we might actually be able to do some abyssal stuff um uh, i have those parts you asked for excellent let me assemble a device for you this should allow you to catch specimens from much deeper depths. Sampling device. Install time three hours. Catches abyssal. Oh, darn it. Um, Hold on a second. We're going to have to move those to... Did those go? Where did those go? Those went to storage. Cargo. Can we uninstall this? And let's throw this into storage. And we'll put this over here. Custom design. Okay, so now that I developed, now I've developed a repulse machine that produces a bright light and emits high pitched noises. It should deter the creature from attacking or enrage it. I'm not sure. Connect it to the research outpost generator. You'll have to return and re engage it every few hours. But other than that, it's completely automated. Repulsion machine, a complicated piece of equipment uh, with lights and a loudspeaker. You're not quite sure which way should be facing. It needs to be attached to the generator. Okay, so, ooh, this is exciting. Now take a look at the specimens. Remember, You'll want to install and activate the machine before attempting to collect these. You might also need to improve the, that equipment I gave you to catch some of these. Okay, so see, that's a haddle. That's an abyssal. That's an abyssal, and that's a haddle. So we can't collect, catch those because those are haddle and not abyssal. Um, okay. Oh, this is exciting. Um, nope, that's it. And I wonder, research... Yes, we can get our own stuff now. That'll do Haddle and Abyssal. So I'd like to get that. Actually, like right now. Let's see if we can't go find a um, an upgrade part. And get that going. Because that would be super nice. All right, come on, lady. Tell me you have an upgrade. No, darn it. <laughs> I was really hoping she had an upgrade for me. Okay. Um, oh, hold on. Let's repair everything. That looks good. Everything looks good there, but that is going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did like subscribe all for things, this is Dredge. Again, link down below if you want to check it out for yourself. Next episode, we will install the machine, the device, and we will uh, fish the Kraken area, which is going to be very interesting to say the least. So, um, yeah, I, like, I'd like to get the upgrade part first, if I could, just so we can have both of them be done. But we'll see. We'll see if that happens. But yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one.